Hey everybody, so here is our wind progression. So what we're going to do, watch it first. So what we do, we if you're a right-handed thrower, you are going to grab the hammer with your left hand. So you're grabbing the handle with the left hand. Okay, so handle grab right there. Then you're gonna cover your left hand with your right hand, all right? So from here, okay, I call this the holster. What you're gonna do is you're going to stay bent, knees past the toes, back straight. You're going to draw, okay? So we go from the holster to a draw. Come back, okay, we're coming out. You might need to do this with some force, but not a whole ton, okay? We don't want the hammer to go just straight above our head um, when we pull it out to start to wind. So might need to have a little bit of force there, but play around with it and see how much you specifically need. Okay, so after the draw, you're coming into, I call this the T, it's not necessarily a T, more of like a right angle, but um, we're gonna call it the T. So we have the holster, okay, draw to the T, okay? Now from this position, what we wanna do is we wanna take it from the front left corner of our head to the back right corner of our head. So here, I'll show you. Take it from the front corner to the back right corner. All right, so we call this, so we have holster, draw, T, comb the hair, and open. Extend and push. Okay, so back it up there just a little bit. So from the T pose, you're combing across your hair to the back right corner, okay? As you're doing that, you'll see me open up to my right side, okay? This allows me to act on the hammer a lot earlier than if I were to keep my shoulders facing forward, okay? So I'm opening up to my right side. My head stays in line with the chest at all times, okay? We're moving with the chest. As I open up and I get all the way open, I want to essentially just looking directly off my right side. Once I get to that point, I'm going and I'm extending my hands out. So extend. As soon as you extend, you're starting to push. Now when we push, we're only using our right, end, our right hand, so try and isolate that and just imagine yourself pushing the right hand as you go through these, um, this mock wind drill, okay? So here we go. We're gonna go and we're gonna grab the hammer and we're gonna, we're gonna do a full motion, okay? We'll slow it down here. This is a drill where being calm and relaxed and focusing on control instead of just trying to rip it around is going to benefit you a lot more, okay? So, I do a couple of them here. So we start from the holster, okay? Holster, draw, T, T, comb, extend, and push, okay? So as soon as, after you get it started, now all you have to do, you don't have to do the, the holster, the draw again, okay? So now all you do is you're going up, as soon as it gets to pretty much on your right shoulder, all right? Right shoulder to the center of your body, you want to go back to a T, to open up, extend, and push. Okay, there'll be more on the push here in later videos. 
but this is our wind progression. My recommendation is to do it without the hammer and if you have a hammer and you're wanting to um, practice it with the hammer, try it without it first, get some confidence in the order of events and then try it slow and then slowly build up until you feel comfortable with it. Go ahead and give it a shot.